Thor's Thunder Thoughts. Your thoughts are your most powerful asset that you have, that you can utilize on every single day basis. I created this podcast to help you weaponize those thoughts and level them up. What is going on, Viking crew? Welcome to another day of elevating your thoughts. I hope you're pumped, ready to strap in, and take your life up to the next level. Because we're going to hit you with the hard stuff today, as I generally do. Talk about those topics that other people don't want to do. Dive into the stuff that most people don't like to be their reality, which is their reality, but they just reject it. So let's dive into the tough stuff here. Um, So often I hear these complaints is like, life is so hard for me. Life keeps doing these things to me. And at the exact same time as life may be doing hard things for you, life is also working for you. And so often you can get trapped into that victim mindset of how hard things are for you and then wallow in those things of self-pity and and uneventful things (laughs) that you'll just end up being stuck and that is tragic to me. I think that is one of the biggest tragedies in our society right now is people getting stuck. And I know a lot of you guys think it like sitting here is being like, Mark, how dare you say these things? You don't know how tough I have it. Honestly, actually, you don't know how tough I have it. You don't know how tough Joe has it. You don't know how t- tough Bobby has it. You don't know how tough Sally has it. And all you're there is thinking is how tough your life is. But if you just change that paradigm and that way of thinking is how grateful and how much abundance you actually have in your life and how these hard things are actually molding you for your future and rising you to be better and more accomplished. Wow. Your life will just change forever. And I think that is one of the biggest things that you can take away from just life in general. It's just like the hard things, the lessons that that are happening to you, They're also happening for you. They're also happening for you to grow, for you to learn something, for you to take something from it. Like I've had times that I just have not shown up the way that I want to show up. I've had tons of those times, tons of times that I am just not at my best. I'm like, how dare the world put that person in my life right now? I needed an easy thing. And it's like, no, no, Mark. No, you did not not need it easy. You needed the perspective that you need to get better. You need to work through some of those demons that you have inside, some of those things that hold you back. And you needed that reminder that you are not done growing. And I'm here to tell you that you're not done growing. I'm here to let you know that it is okay to fail, but it is not okay to stay in that state of failure. Wallow in it. Have pity for yourself. Give yourself grace. Give yourself lots of grace for the tough times because you definitely deserve the grace and you are human, but do not stay in that state. You are better than that and you do deserve more than that. So today, if something bad happens to you, think of what it's doing for you all at the same time. Let me know in the comments of exactly what happened to you and exactly if you don't know why it happened to you, I'll give you some perspective. I'll help you work through this. I'll help you show that your life is abundant. But anyways, guys, I will see you tomorrow on the next episode.